Hi, this is Brian Stark, and I'm going to show you how to add contacts and operators and set permissions for each. A nice feature of Trimbleleg software is that you can limit the amount of access your team members receive. For some, you may give full permission, while others you give limited access. To get started, click the Contacts button. Here we have a list of existing contacts that we've added so far. To add a new one, click the Manage button and select Add Contact. We'll enter our team member, John Smith, job title name, and we can add a new one here as well, and email. To the right, we can fill in his phone numbers. The System Access tab is where the real magic begins, and so if this contact will be used in the software via online or mobile app, we can set permissions here. Start with their email address. This is the email that they'll use to log in to Trimbleag software. Click the Web and Mobile button to restrict permissions. The system will assume your new contact should not see financial information, but if you want them to see field profitability, purchases, and other financials, check the box. If the contact needs admin privileges for inviting org members, restricting permissions, and full access of the software, check the admin box. The next option is great for contacts you need limited admin privileges. The operator manager option gives them the ability to add or edit contacts, but they can't remove them from the system. Mobile only and time tracker only are for organizations that have multiple users of each. Usually this option is for unique Trimble accounts. And if you want that contact to have no mobile capability, but able to add and see records online, check the box. Note when this option is selected, the user won't have financial access. The last permission to mention is the mobile app restrictions. If you want that contact to have limited access to field activity tiles on the mobile app, set them here. For example, if this person only needs bin management, this can be selected from the list and only that tile will appear on the mobile app. Also the years will need selected. Keeping it to all will give the mobile user access to all years of bin management. And further, you can allow that person to only view or edit the details for that activity. Click the check mark to save it. Moving on to the Equipment Operator tab, if this contact is an operator used for field record keeping, check the box. An applicator license and unit cost can be entered. And if you assign this person on a field activity, the cost will be viewable on the Profitability tab within Field Manager. If you are setting permissions on the Trimble GFX 750 or TMX 2050 displays, a username and PIN number can be created. By doing this step, the operator will be forced to enter their credentials on the display prior to using it. The system can also print QR codes that perform the same step, giving them access to the Trimble display. And from the drop-down for Precision IQ, there's two options, full access and select only. If you choose select, the user cannot add new items to the display. They can only pick existing ones. Now we'll click save to add the contact. Thank you for learning more about adding contacts and setting permissions. Please subscribe to our channel to stay updated on future video releases.